he trusts him places. Um, uh, because that's the name of the book, <laughs> we're talking about uh, the, the Etruscan place I have been to. He's been to a lot of other places, different from the weirdness of Celtic places. You know, in England there are these old Celtic stone circles and things you may or may not know about. Uh, Rome, which he considers repellent, the rather abhorrent uh, kind of um, repelling sort of thing of the Great Pyramid places in Mexico. He's been to the Great Pyramids and look at this guy, he's been everywhere. It's only the 1920s and, the, and there were no jet planes. So he's been to all these places <coughs> and he did it with the rucksack on his back. Remember he describes the rucksack uh, at the railroad station and nobody will take it because it doesn't have a key. And he leaves it at the, uh, at the, coffee, uh, at the coffee bar or something because the guy's willing to uh, take it. Uh, any case, he's been to Teotihuacan and Chihuahua and Mitla in the south. The, 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 uh, uh, Teotihuacan. I've been to Teotihuacan. Have you been to Teotihuacan? It's a huge place north of Mexico City. You know, really huge pyramids. I mean, like, as big as the Egyptian pyramids. Uh, you know, it's reconstructed. Uh, if you go to Mexico, you certainly should go to Teotihuacan. Uh, uh, and uh, further south in Mexico is Oaxaca, where they're having all the social unrest at the moment. And I forget the name of the, of the town on the hillside above Oaxaca. But they have the same pyramids there. And, uh, even more, uh, to my mind, spectacular because they haven't been reconstructed. I can't remember the name of the place above Oaxaca, but Lawrence lived in Oaxaca, so he, he knows about these places. He lived in Lake Chapale, he lived in Oaxaca. He knows about all these, so you see, he knows, he knows quite a lot. He knows more than almost anyone you meet knows through personal experience. Uh, Midla, Chilola, those are down by um, Cancun area, the, mountain, the Mayan sort of places out inland from Cancun. You know, everyone goes to Cancun to sort of uh, you know, play around, drink, I don't know, whatever they do in those places. But the real place to go is inland, in the, in the jungle area, so where they have these uh, uh, Mayan ruins. That would be Midland, Chilola. He's been to the Buddha, temp uh, Buddha uh, temples in Ceylon. What's the difference here? In this little weird place here in Nowheresville that no one's ever heard of, there is a stillness and a softness in those great grassy mounds with their ancient stone girdles and down the central walls are linked to a kind of homeliness. Something simple, something pleasant. Yeah? It's called Sri Lanka now. Yeah, but I know that, but he's calling it Sela. <laughs> That's a British name, okay. Yeah, I know. I know. Well, I saw Bombay and Mumbai, so you know, but, uh, we're reading it. But, okay. You guys, my friend here wants you to know it's not Ceylon anymore. It's